My guest tonight is an award-winning actor who's appeared on Doctor Doctor, Play School, and Get Kraken, and she's just premiered her own film at the Sundance Film Festival. So she's clearly peaked. Would you please welcome Miranda Tapsell? Yeah. Hello. Hi, Ray. Welcome back. Thanks um, for having me back. Now. We will get to your film, Top End Wedding, very shortly. But the first time we had you here was way back in 2015 and you had just won the Logie for Best New Talent. Are you serious? That it's is, been that long? It has been that long. And you've done a lot in the meantime, uh, not least of which you just got married. Look at this. This is you <laughs> and your husband. Now, that, that is James. He's actually one of the guys who writes for The Weekly. Yes. He's part of our team here. <laughs> And uh, I was always under the impression that, um, that when you came on in tw 2015 that you had met by coming on the show and that I had played a really big role in you guys getting together. And it turns out I was wrong? Yes, you were, in every way, because you, <laughs> you, you told James... Well, I think many people behind the scenes told James, don't speak to the talent. <laughs> <laughs> Um, and uh, I remember actually um, uh, backstage, like I had, I had, I think walked past him in the in the hallway, and he went. <laughs> <laughs> he, just walked, he just walked like completely in the opposite direction to me. Has he has he carried that obedience over to married life? Yes. Has he done that? <laughs> <laughs> and he's, he knows what he's signed up for. So. <laughs> <laughs> now your new movie is Top End Wedding and it premiered at Sundance. Yes. It's like a bit of a wild goose chase because you're, tr <laughs> you're trying to find your mum who's missing before the wedding. Yeah. And that means you get to tick off, like, Catherine, like, everything, mm -hmm. you like, Kakadu. It's all the places I grew up, you know? I was born in Darwin. I grew up in Kakadu. Um, I went to school camp in Catherine, so I'm glad I got to show all of that off. I, I would say, like, it's just beautiful. You're in... You're in Tiwi, it's, uh, the Tiwi Islands. What was that like? That is where your family is from. Yes. What was it like filming there? We wanted to celebrate them. We wanted to celebrate their art, their songs and their love of family because that's how they've embraced me whenever I've gone back to the islands. I've always been someone's niece, granddaughter, cousin and uh, I... Oh, I just love that part of the world and I'm really, really proud to come from there. But a lot of the people, a lot of people in the movie... Yeah. Aren't, ..weren't actors. No. A lot of them were locals just participating. Yes. Uh, the women who were in the choir, they are just so gorgeous. They were thinking that it was my actual wedding. Oh, <laughs> oh really? <laughs> They're like, gee, this is... This ceremony's taking a long time. <laughs> <laughs> Well, it is a beautiful movie. It's out May the 2nd. Uh, but something else that you've been working on lately caused a bit of a stir last week. You were in the final episode of Get Kraken. In the episode, you and Nakia Louie, you step in for the two Kates to take over hosting the show. And over the course of the morning, the makeup lady <laughs> progressively lightens your makeup to the point that you just snap. 30 years of smiling and making big eyes and not showing my anger. I'm done not being angry. I am angry. And if you don't like me being angry, then by all means, Australia, take my furious button and run this race for me. <laughs> now, <laughs> the, the obvious question that has to be asked is, should you really be doing whiteface on TV? <laughs> <laughs> Um, uh, look, um... <laughs> it's, there's quite a contrast between that and so the beautiful, gentle portrayal of the Tiwi Islands in the film. And I'm just curious, what do you think is a more powerful way to get people to change their minds and to think? Is it, is it the, the anger or perhaps the, the telling of a beautiful story? That's such an interesting question because, um, I mean, that's something we've always grappled with in terms of race relations around the world. For me, I think there's no right way to do it, you know? You've, you've always got to go with your gut on that and you've always got to respond to a moment that you've... a, a circumstance that you've been in to, to be able to respond the way that you want to. Well, we are big fans of yours here at The Weekly. All the best with the new movie, Top End Wedding. Would you please thank Miranda Tapsell? Yeah.